Welcome back, Rankers. Thank you to everybody yesterday at uh, Business Now. It was a uh, fantastic conference over at uh, Mooney Valley. And uh, to all those people this morning, including uh, Lizzie C. Photo, um, who was there yesterday, thank you very much for the lovely comments. Um, so what happened overnight? Well, yesterday, uh, Google announced uh, a new version of Google, or an updated version of Google, called Caffeine. Now, I find this quite interesting. We're not seeing a lot of differences yet. I've been asked a lot about it, including um, Leaping Judas this morning uh, on Twitter. I'll log out there. Uh, and it's basically at the, at the Google Webmaster Central blog yesterday, they announced that they've been doing a lot of work on, on Google. It's all under the hood, so you're not going to notice any changes on the face of it. They've actually said that you probably won't see a lot of changes initially um, but I've just we've been playing with it a bit yesterday and also this morning and I just wanted to point out a couple of things uh, that we're seeing that seem to be different but it's too hard to tell until the thing goes live anyway but if you are interested in uh, in these things I suggest you go and check out the Google Webmaster Central blog and uh, and have a look there the uh, the article is called help test some next generation infrastructure so let's have a look what we did, uh, and I say we, but I mean me, um, what I've been mucking about with this morning is just having a look at the two Googles. We've got a, a normal google.com.au, and the search I've done here is government internet filter, and we're searching the web. Um, and you can see it seems fairly, well, to me, it seems fairly similar to what it's always been uh, on google.com.au. Then we go to the, the test bed, of the, the new version of Google called Caffeine. Uh, and you can see here the address is, is slightly different. Um, and the, the top five spots, six spots seem about the same. Uh, you know, we've got the, uh, the government net alert uh, website, which is number one for government internet filter. Uh, and then we've got net alert at number two as well. Then we've got News Limited. And then we've got my two videos. Uh, and then right down the bottom, uh, we've got our website as well there. And, if, and that's on the normal Google. Then if we go and have a look at the new Google, uh, we find that you know, this is pretty much the same up until about this point. Uh, and then down around here, we're starting to see some differences. We've got Choice Magazine in here. Uh, we're, our site's still down the bottom there. But if we go back over here, Choice isn't actually in here. Smart Company's in here. Uh, and also uh, Whirlpool Forums. Now, one of the things that I'm hoping is going to happen, one of the, one of the other sites that's missing uh, in the new Google is this Libertus Net um, run by Irene Graham, I believe. Uh, and that's missing from the new Google as well. What I am hoping for is we've seen that um, Whirlpool, the forum site, um, which is in case you're not watching this from Australian, uh, from Australian shores, um, Whirlpool is a very, very well respected um, uh, forum for people who, they started out really as an, as an ISP uh, discussion forum, and they're much, much, big, much, much bigger than that now. But they're not featuring in the new, new Google, uh, and the Choice Magazine is. I'm hoping, one of the changes I'm hoping to see, and I, and I don't know whether this will happen or not, is less emphasis placed on forum backlinks as far as rankings go. We don't do a lot of it. Um, in fact, we don't do any of it unless we're actually participating in the forums. A trend over recent times, and uh, frequent viewers to this video blog uh, will remember this, that um, we don't do forum um, backlinks and we don't do uh, blog backlinks unless we're actually participating in that blog or in that forum. There is a trend for, for SEOs in this country and around the world to just go out and spam forums and comment spam blogs. And um, my own blog uh, on stuartmedia.biz has been, and as have other parts of the site, um, has been spammed a lot and by even local Australian companies. And what I'm hoping to see is with this new Google that we actually see that sort of backlink downgraded by Google. Because every backlink, in case you're, you're new here, Every backlink that you have to your site is like a vote for your site. And what a lot of people are doing 
is just trying to go out and get backlinks from forums. The problem with that that I have is that it's noise and you're not contributing to the discussion. And I belong to quite a few forums and one thing I hate is people just coming into the forum and putting, hey, check out this site, backlink, bang. It just adds to the noise and it's spam essentially. And the same applies to, uh, to blogs. Basically, if you go in and comment spam a, a blog, and by that I mean you go in and you leave a comment for no other reason except that you want a backlink from that site, that's spam as well. And you're passing your marketing costs onto the person who owns and runs that blog. That's why we don't do um, blog or forum spam. And I'm hoping in this change that we're going to see some of that. Um, and, but once again, I say it's too early to tell at the moment. But the last uh, lot of these changes that, that we saw, or the last really big change that we saw was, was probably um, October 2007. And in that change that we, that we had, a lot of our clients all of a sudden just went up into the top three. And it was because one of the major changes Google made back then is that they announced that they were detecting if you were paying for backlinks as well. Because Google downplayed that, because if you're paying for backlinks, it's a bit like buying friends. It's not, it's not real. So Google downplayed that last time, and because we don't buy backlinks, a lot of our sites went up. So I'm hoping the same is going to apply with this change in Google. And if you want to go and have a play with it, go and check out the Google Webmaster Central blog. And check that out. Also today on the Google Webmaster uh, Central blog, we have uh, an announcement of a whole bunch of different programs for hosting companies. So if you are a hosting company, go and check out uh, the Google Webmaster blog today. And that is it for today's show. Remember, if you have got news we can use, or if you want questions answered, or even if you'd like your website featured on the show for all the world to see of what you're trying to rank for, then let us know. We've done it for a couple of people and they appreciated it. Not something I'd do, because I don't want other people knowing what my keywords are, but I'm happy to do it for you on the show if you are having trouble getting your site ranked and don't mind the rest of the world uh, seeing your site and being an example. We're happy to do that for you. And uh, we'll see you next week. Thanks very much. Remember, there's nothing like a good rank.